Hi, welcome to Ramster. Today I'll be unboxing my Samsung Gear VR. And this one I showed during my CES video and it just never really got around to opening the box. It just, so far this works with the Samsung Galaxy S6 or S6 Edge. And well, for me, I was personally very excited about this kind of product because I'm not tethered to a PC. Yes, that's what we got here. It looks like straps. This here, Gear VR, straps here, and a box of accessories. So I'm going to put this to a side for now. And for the box of accessories, we have a oh, something stuck right here. Looks like cleaning cloth, a getting started guide and a, a carrying pouch and some other foam oh this looks like a uh, head foam face plate on the, on the gear vr we got touch buttons on the side a return button right up here let me see what this exposes so here for the power micro usb thing here hmm. Gear VR powered by Oculus. Let's press this to check the smartphone tray. And up here, I can either push the, the smartphone further from the eyes or closer to move it closer to the eyes. Oh, there's plastic protection everywhere. And I believe this these are light sensors. Personally, I think Gear VR is a step up above those other VR headsets that sells for about $30, $40 on Amazon. And it's definitely a step up from the Google Cardboard. But it it's just can't compete with things like the Oculus Rift or the HTC Vive yet. But I like how they're off. It's pretty expensive too. It's like I think this goes for about $100 or so. I'm not sure I got this from Oculus at the Oculus event. So we got a head support on top over here and velcro st straps on both sides and the foam padded on the back here for user comfort here's that traveling bag it doesn't have any logo on it other than this part right here that says gear vr let's open this up fit the unit in flaps it and there's drawstrings on both sides of it for me to close it up and tie it up at the Oculus event, they also gave us the Steel Series remote control for the Gear VR. And I'm pretty sure I can use it with other devices too. Powered by two AA batteries. And here's the remote control. It has a very good feel to it. I mean, obviously, it looks just like an Xbox controller, heavier than I expected. Uh, the buttons up on top, I'm not too fond of it, but everything else, I'm okay with it. Um, I'm not too fond of these buttons so far already because it's smaller than I expected or hoped. Taking a look at the buttons on top, looks like we have Wi-Fi connection, battery indicator, R1, R2, L1, L2. Then LED status indicator, number of buttons here. On-off switch on the back. And the battery compartment for the two AA batteries. I know the Gear VR has been out for a while, but I finally got around to opening it. Well, thanks for watching this unboxing. If you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, feel free to contact me. Thanks for watching with Gramster. Bye.